Fox 14. I'm Kyla Scott. And I'm Stephen Pappas. First on Fox, the search continues for a missing juvenile in Camden who was last seen playing in the Washita River with his friends. Fox 14's Nick Summer was on the scene earlier today and has more details. Sunday evening around uh, 5 p.m., uh, we received a call of a person in distress down here at the river. That person in distress on Sunday evening was a Camden juvenile who was out playing in the river with some friends. But no foul play is suspected as this is being ruled an accidental drowning. The Camden Fire Department launched rescue boats along with numerous civilians and personal boats initially started the search. The Office of Emergency Management of Miller County Dive Team with 12 divers and sonar surface joined in the search. He did drown and we have been searching uh, for the body. Directly behind me is part of the Washita River where the missing Camden resident was last seen. This area has been heavily searched by the Camden Police Department over the past couple of days. Donna Weatherby says the water levels in the river on Sunday evening were extremely high due to the storms we had throughout the Arkham list last week, and this could have potentially played a role in the accidental drowning. At the time of uh, the accident, the river levels was around 28 feet, and water temperatures were around 50 degrees, maybe a little, a little bit higher, but the water was definitely cold, and um, the river was at flood stage. Weatherby says the Camden Police Department, as well as the Camden Fire and Rescue Squads, will keep searching the river until the body is found, no matter how long it takes. Reporting in Camden for your weather station, I'm Nick Summer.